what's up guys this is Kef here from Norway's and today I'm gonna show you how you can customize the navigation bar of your device without routing. If you have a rooted device that's great but if you don't have a rooted device there's no problem you can also customize your navigation bar without routing it. The very first thing you have to do is download an app from the play store with the name custom navigation bar. If you have a rooted device, there is no need of a computer but a non-rooted one requires a computer on the very first time. You will require some platform tools which you can download from the link in the description below. Now you have to extract these files. So here I do the extracting part of these files. So after the extracting process is done, you have to copy that new folder into your C drive. Just paste this folder in your C drive. So in your platform tools, you will get another platform tools folder where inside you will get all the files. Now connect your phone to your computer. Now back to your PC, remember that you need a command prompt. You cannot go into Windows PowerShell. Let's start with the Windows PowerShell first. If you go into your Windows PowerShell, you will see that the command you type will not be actually taken by the Windows PowerShell and you will have problems with them. So you will need a command prompt with this. So go in your start menu and search for cmd and then you can open the command prompt. So here we have the command prompt open. Now the very first command you type is cd c that is your c drive colon backslash then platform dash tools again backslash platform dash tools. This is the folder which you just copied into your c drive then hit enter. Now in there you have to type adb devices. So this will recognize your device which is connected to your PC. Now you have to type a command that is adb shell. Now inside you have to type this command and you can find this command in the link in the description below. That is pm grant xyz dot pap honb dot system ituner space android dot, dot permission dot write underscore secure underscore settings. Then hit enter and then you are done. This is the only initial process where you will need your PC if you have a non-rooted device. And now you will have all the access to your app. So this will do a compatibility test at the start and then you can finish. Now you are into the app. Now there is no need of a computer. You will see that in your navigation bar settings you have many more options. In your layout you have the left leaning or the right leaning option if you are a left handed user or a right handed one. You have the compact, the tablet mode or, or, or the center as well. There are many layouts in this app. You can also swap the navigation keys using the inverted option but you also have the normalized button size where each and every button is of the same size. Then you have many themes where you get the pixel theme or you can get the theme which is present on the S8 as well. You can get the s 8 navigation bar but you have to buy the pro version for that. If you want the pro version you can get it from the link in the description below. So with the pro version you can get the pixels navigation bar or also the s 8 navigation bar and many more other options. So this app is great and will actually help you customize your navigation bar. So you also have other options like the hide status bar and the other ones as well. You can also hide your navigation bar or from your screen and you can just swipe up to get them back. So guys this was a short video on how you can customize your navigation bar. Thanks for watching guys because that really helps and do subscribe to our channel for more of these kind of videos. With that being said, my name is Kev, you are watching Noise Tech and we are signing out.